All this month, get any smartphone 32 gig and under for 50% off regular price at Appalachian Wireless. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. While supplies last, two-year agreement required. A group of students, faculty, and community members gathered on the Prestonsburg campus of Big Sandy Community and Technical College earlier today to learn about the Tuskegee Airmen. Big Sandy officials brought Ron Spriggs to campus so he could share the amazing story of the African-American military pilots who fought in World War II. I'm going to talk about the origin of the Tuskegee Airmen, uh, why they came into being, some of the things that they had to fight against during the, the Jim Crow era. Spriggs himself is an eight-year United States Air Force veteran and spends much of his time traveling, talking to audiences about a part of American history he says is seldom taught in schools. I do travel all over the country, mostly in the um, uh, east of the Mississippi, a lot of it in, in Kentucky. I've been as far west as California. Last year this time I was in Santa Clara. Prior to World War II, no African American had been a U.S. military pilot, and their fight to serve in the air is part of the history Spriggs shares with his audience, and eastern Kentucky is one of his favorite stops. But this is my third trip out here to uh, this campus, and I'm just tickled pink that even though the years have separated since the last visit, i got a new batch of students that I can share America's probably best kept secret about the Tuskegee Airmen. Because he says the Tuskegee Airmen are not just black history, but a huge part of American history. Reporting in Prestonsburg for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.